that the Delhi government has presented its budget for 2023-24 with a focus on boosting infrastructure. In the absence of Manish Sisodia, Kailash Gelod presented the budget. In the speech, Gelod said that the Delhi government has allotted 16,575 crore rupees for education and is also allotting 850 crore rupees for cleanliness project with an eye on beautifying the city ahead of the G20 next year. The Delhi government has set aside 9,333 crores for transport and will even start the facility of electric scooter sharing with 1,500 e-scooters deployed for the last mile connectivity. 3,500 crores have been set aside for Mohalla Bus Yojana. 29 new flyovers, 1,600 new zero emission buses and 1,400 new bus depots also figured in the budget proposal. ये वाला बजट है जो साफ सुंदर और आधुनिक दिल्ली कैपिटल सिटी है हमारी लोग आए तो उनको लगना चाहिए कि एक महान देश की राजधानी में गए हैं इस बार इस बजट में देर इज अज यूज यूज इंफ्रा पुश लगभग इक्कीस हजार करोड़ रुपए इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर के ऊपर खर्च किए जाएंगे इस बजट में 26 नए फ्लाईओवर और बनाने जा रहे हैं तीन अपने अलग किस्म के यूनिक किस्म के डबल डेकर फ्लाईओवर बनाए जाएंगे आप जो मेट्रो देखते हो ना मेट्रो चलती है अब उसी के नीचे एक लेवल और बनाया जाएगा ऊपर मेट्रो चलेगी और नीचे वो चलेगी बस ये सड़क होगी इस साल आश्रम फ्लाईओवर और अंडरपास का काम भी पूरा हो गया जिससे दिल्ली में करीब चार लाख जिससे दिल्ली में करीब चार लाख वाहनों का दैनिक आवागमन आसान हो गया मुझे ये बताते हुए मुझे ये बताते हुए गर्व हो रहा है कि पिछले आठ वर्षों में पीडब्ल्यू ने 28 नए फ्लाईओवर अध्यक्ष जी 28 नए फ्लाईओवर एलिवेटेड एलिवेटेड सड़क सड़कों और पुलों का निर्माण किया है जिससे दिल्ली में आवागमन काफी आसान हो गया है Niyamika is joining us live. Niyamika, infra boost seems to be the centerpiece of the Delhi budget presented today. Uh, does this plug all the loopholes? Does it close all the gaps that the citizens suffer on a day-to-day -day basis in the city of Delhi? Absolutely, and uh, this was the issue on which uh, there were certain allegations which were being leveled against the Aam Aadmi Party government when uh, uh, this budget was being delayed as a question was being raised that uh, the total allocation on the infrastructural boost uh, is uh, less than uh, the uh, allocation which is being given for the advertisements and that is uh, the allegation which was being put upon the Aam Aadmi Party led Delhi government but uh, uh, now uh, today the Delhi government has presented its uh, budget in the absence of Manish Sodia and it is um, being made very clear on the part of the Ahmadi party that the main focus of this entire budget is upon the infrastructure growth of the national capital as uh, it is being uh, made uh, clear by Kailash Gehlot while presenting this budget that uh, the G20 summit is coming up and uh, all the countries are uh, going to eye, uh, put an eye upon uh, the national capital of our country. So the main focus of the Delhi government will be to give an infrastructural boost and that is the reason why uh, 20,000 crore has been allocated uh, for all the developmental work uh, which is even uh, related uh, to for the constructions of uh, new flyovers, underpasses and uh, even double-decker flyovers are also going to be prepared by the Delhi government and uh, allocation is being made uh, regarding that as well. On the right. other hand, a new scheme has also been announced by today, uh, Kailash Gehloth, in which it is being stated that uh, there will be a last mile connectivity that is going to be done, in which mini bus buses are going to be introduced so that uh, all this issue which was being there earlier uh, with the DTC buses as they were uh, in, uh, not being able to touch upon each and every location of Delhi, that will be resolved as mi mini buses are, is going to be introduced uh, by the Delhi government very soon. So this is the enti uh, entire focus of the Delhi 
government uh, to give uh, a beautification model of uh, the Aam Aadmi Party government in uh, the national capital and uh, it is also being claimed by the Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal in today's press conference that there will be no potholes on the roads of uh, Delhi and uh, it will be the accountability of uh, the agency who is uh, going to develop or revamp the, uh, the previous road uh, for the maintenance as well as a contract will be given for 10 years and it will be responsible for all the maintenance as well as for the beautification of uh, these roads and footpaths as uh, it is also going to impact upon the environment of the national capital because uh, the dust pollution is also going to be reduced by all the initiatives which is being taken by the Delhi government and that yes. is being made uh, very clear by Kailash Gehloth as well as uh, by the Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal. Right. Uh, I heard Mr. Gehlot say Saf Sundar or Adhunik Delhi. That is uh, supposed to be the vision in front of the Ahmadbi party. But this is, of course, uh, in only in so far as announcements and proposals are made at the moment. We'll still have to wait and see what implementation is done. Thanks very much uh, for joining us, Niamika, with your inputs on the story.